Hey guys, welcome back to tuning in to Bad Box Pulls. And today we have another boom box. So this will be my third one that I'm open, uh, opening up. And this is for the month of June. Um, this is for the Platinum Basketball. And for Platinum Basketball, um, it is, I believe, $140. So half the cost of um your average your uh elite box um and then same thing you know you get six to ten packs um any retail or fast breaks will be disclosed um at least four packs will be uh the featured packs and then you get the uh magnetic one touch case as well so let's see what we get um i won't be opening up like a bad luck pack because i think that didn't work for basketball so um We'll see how it goes with this uh, platinum box. All right, let's see here. A bunch of peanut packs as before. Um, let's see. A uh, full cello pack can be in there. I mean, I mean, ugh, cello packs. All right, let's see how many packs there are. There should be six or more. So let's go ahead and see what we got. So many packing peanuts. Um, but let me get everything out. another contenders and that's it another uh whew. um but that's about it hopefully we have all six we looks like we have a six i guess so this is your 80 point again so i think they just buy these in bulk and just put them in to your uh box put that there See if it comes to use all right and that is our potentials let's see what we have so we do have an nba hoops non-hobby though i think these are just uh i think these are just the base right These packs don't even go for like less than three dollars if it's non-hobby. But I think this is just a base pack, non-hobby. Feel really chipped getting this one. That's one, right? We have a contenders. So contenders hobby. This one is a hobby. Said uh, Donruss Elite. Let's see if we have a Donruss Elite. Donruss Elite. Okay, yeah. Twenty twenty to twenty twenty one Donruss Elite. I don't know why they underlined it like it was something different. Then we have Optics Full Cello Pack. Yeah, I mean, I don't know about the cello packs. Revolutions hobby. So we got the Revolutions. This one is a hobby, confirmed. So we got four, and then the Donruss hobby, 1718, as mentioned. This one doesn't even say if it's a hobby. Typically they do. I don't know about for Donra specifically. Um, and then we got this extra. So we have three, four, five, and one lane. We'll start off with the NBA hoops. I'm pretty sure this is a non-hobby. This is just like one of those regular packs. It's a little upsetting because this value is nowhere near close to 140. I I don't think it think so. So definitely I think they made their money here. Uh, but I didn't. I don't think I, I I'm even close. So that this is NBA hoops. Um base, base, base. So a little bit 
not happy about this pack. Road to Finals, Kevin Durant. That's your only hit. I'm Moses Mood, uh, Moses Moody, but not even just a base card there. But I, I yeah, as far as with this, this one's numbered. So 2021. It's hard to see there. Let's see, we got a numbered card. It's out of 2022, 2021. So which is. I'll take a numbered card all the time. So, I mean, this card probably worth nothing though. Maybe a dollar or two. But numbered card always gets sleep, as I mentioned, and a top loader. Um, yeah, so this actually might have been a hobby pack. Um, I'm not too sure, but I'm, I'm assuming it isn't though. GC1221. I gotta look at the codes. So I'm not too sure about this one. Uh, but who cares? Pull the numbered card. And then we'll move on to 17, 18 donors, I guess. I wanna save the elite. I guess we'll do the solo. We'll do the contenders after the revolutions and then the elite. Um, we'll, let's look at the 18, uh, 17, 18 donors. Hobby. Come on. Last time was a was BS. Let's see. Corner's a little nicked. Simmons. Wesley. The champ is here. Insert. Dwayne Wade. Okay. Take the insert though. So nothing though. DeAndre Jordan, Levine. I don't know. Like I, I, I don't think I, I really like Donner's hobby. I mean, what, what's the hit that you're supposed to look for? I mean, is there something I don't know about Donner's? Because I, I, I don't open up like the older Donner. I never opened up the older Donner's. Like I have no clue if I'm supposed to look for a specific hit. But I'm pretty sure I hit nothing there. Like I'm pretty dang sure. Um, I think all we're supposed to really look out for is the rated rookies, right? And then see if they come in like the prism styles. Put that right there. We'll go on to contenders. As always, contender. Oh man, dropping packs again. All right. Well. Don't forget to like and subscribe for my butterfingers. Put them up for good luck so that way I don't drop any more packs moving forward. Um, as always, Contender is my worst nemesis. We'll see what we pull today. All these base cards. Near the end, you always... That's your hit card, so... Let's see, RJ. Oh, man. Ooh, what's this? Lottery tickets. Jalen Green lottery ticket. Okay. I like this one. Is it numbered? Not numbered. So it's not like the it's not like the other uh lottery ticket where where they have like the fake autos. I mean, I would, I would love to see a fake 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 auto like contenders uh football if you see their lotto tickets. Um you know, they ha they have your they have their uh autos that let me see if i have one just lying around somewhere like for instance like this oh never mind this is a winning ticket but that's my homes look at that badly printed card but i thought it, it would have their fake autos like right there but guess not but it's, it is a nice card i will sleeve it up i think it's a cool card and it's shaling green not a bad one but other than that like i said really tough to hit anything on contenders like this is your average like what you'll see like what i just did that's your normal average don't be expecting too much all right we'll move on to our optics how much do optics go for just a cello i think i don't think they even go for much anymore i think the pri pri prices have dropped a lot um so 
you were supposed to find three blue velocity prisms. Um, yada yada yada. You can pause the video if you want to take a look at that. But honestly, don't really have too high hopes for a solo pack. But we'll get into it. We'll see. You never know your luck. All right, that was 2020 to 2021. So, Jackson Hayes, Chris Middleton, LeBron James, cool. I mean, it's LeBron, but Westbrook, cool. Drew Holiday. Ooh, Chris Middleton. Look at this uh, splash card. It's a prism. That's a cool card, too. Lillard Express Lane. Non-prism, though. Yeah. It's a nice insert. Winner stays insert. Nice. David Robinson. It's a cool insert. So they got cool inserts. Um, Elijah Hughes. Pukovetsky. Uh, I don't even know how to say his name. Uh, Zubin Duku. So, like I mentioned, shh, really bad with optics. Hard to get hits in general, especially on a solo. So, um, kind of expect that. Just to go exactly like that. But we'll see in the promo pack there. See if there's anything good. But Middleton wise, prisms, I'll sleep up. But this is where we have to look out, right? This is where it's a, it's a hit or miss. This is where it is, right? I think. I already can kind of see the first first card. Uh, I think it's going to be a, a miss. You never know with these bonus packs. You never know. So, Cam, Harrison Barnes, and Zach. Cool cards though. Um, just leave them up because they're prisms and exclusive, just to the cellos. I don't know how the print runs go, but cool cards. Wonder if if you got a Raider rookie and if you can get the Raider rookies or the rookies in in these optics in the blues. I think that'll be cool. All right, next one up, Revolutions. Um, probably tough to pull anything from here, too. Let's see. You got Kazuma. Yeah. You have Sadiq Bey. Okay, Sadiq. John Wall. Usman. Mm. Yeah, Josh Giddy. Nice. Take the Josh Giddy. Especially for a rookie card, although it's like a base. I'll still take it. I believe these are bases, right? I mean, with, with, with Revolutions, it's hard to tell. I know... Yeah, I think this is a base because these are just like the wave base or something like that. But I'd love to get a numbered card for from this. Sucks. I mean, Sadiq's a nice card. I mean, I, I don't know if I should even sleep him up. It's not even worth the sleeve, in my opinion. The last one is uh, Elite. My hope is on you. Uh, but looking at it, the Platinum Box is... Damn, it's tough too. So Elite is for 2020-2021. Jeez. Um, Overall, um, yeah, definitely didn't make my money in any of the boom boxes. That's one thing for sure. Um, but that's how it is when you open up packs, right? Like, 
trio. Dylan Brooks. Numbered Bradley Beal out of 99. And probably the rest is going to be garbage. Jimmy Butler. Because after you hit a numbered, you really don't get another numbered card. Uh, old Dalibo. Yep. So that's it. We, we got our numbered card. The rest is going to be... Uh, ooh, shoot. Trey Young. But that's it. You got your Bradley Beal numbered. Um, out of 99. So, uh, Platinum Box, man. Sheesh. I don't, yeah, I mean, that's about it. I mean, will I do Boombox again? Probably not. I should have looked, I should have looked carefully and seeing if these are the two numbered cards. I should have seen if they had, if they didn't have the cello pack because I'm not a big fan of any type of cello pack in general. Um, this is a cool card, uh, Jalen Green. Um, these are all the prisms and the and the non-prism. This is a groove, uh, which is not really popular, right? I'm, I'm guessing. Um, nothing special about these. These are all just base for sure. Um, from here, Sadiq Bay was probably a good one. These are all just the same. This was from Optic Cello. Elijah Puku, Pukuzaveski. Yeah. So no no rookies either. No, actually we had two right here. Three. But nothing special. Um and then you had your contenders. Contenders always completely garbage. It's or it's not garbage. It's just tough to pull, as as I always say. Um, nothing here too. I don't think so. I mean, unless I'm supposed to look for something special in Donruss. Yeah. And unfortunately, I don't know too much about Donruss products during that time to know if I supposed to pull anything. And then as far as for hoops, come on. Like hoops, you're better off just getting the blaster. I'm just, I'm just saying. But that's about it. I mean, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope you guys uh, tune in for another episode. I have a couple other things planned, but um, we'll see how it goes. But definitely like and subscribe. See you guys next time.